Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about every deluxe Marvel Legends. First deluxe figure we got was the X Men Archangel with the four different head sculpts and the Apocalypse Build a Figure extra hand that we can get. Next we got as a deluxe, we got the giant man from Captain America Civil War and they got him all crunched down in this package. Looks like he's at the airport and they actually made this one more movie accurate than the actual build figure was. Then we got the Target exclusive Red Hulk figure. Really impressed by this. It was a nice repaint and reuse of that mold for the Hulk. We got the Scarlett Johansson Black Widow figure. Got all these blast effects and hands and guns and whatnot. Got the figure stand as well. Got the Monster Venom repaint. Got the GameStop Game in Reverse. Outback Hulk from the Avengers game. Next, we got the classic War Machine with the roadie head there from the 80s. Got all kinds of blast effects on this guy as well. Here's the back of the package. And then we got the repaint, re-release of the Age of Apocalypse Apocalypse figure here from the regular Apocalypse Build figure. Don't mind this repaint at all. Got two head sculpts, one menacing, one smiling. Comes with that extra skull. Then we got the repaint of the Monster Venom Build figure again, this time as Toxin. Yeah, he's got these crazy tentacles coming off his back. Got the green tongue, nice big head. Red going into the black, very nice figure. This is the Deluxe Thanos. And we're celebrating 30 years of the Infinity Gauntlet storyline. Awesome, awesome. It comes with the King Thanos head as well. You can switch that out if you want to. And then in the background, you get a diorama type thing, like a throne that you could use. Kind of stand behind it if you want to to make it look like, like this right here. And there's the packaging as well. It also comes with three different Infinity Gauntlet hands. One's a fist, one's open, and one is snapping. And there's the back of that package with Death talking to his ear in the background. So this box is really awesome. So there's that King Thanos, and there's that diorama in the background you can use. So here's the unofficial front and back of the package for the Crow figure from the Eternals movie that of course got pushed back to 2021. There are all of the deluxe figures that came in the deluxe boxes. Here's a kind of a wish list or most wanted list for what I'd love to see redone. Maybe the strong guy build a figure and even the space venom with a new head sculpt. Mine those being done as deluxes as well. 
So these are actually kind of deluxe as well because they were builder figures and they were repackaged. So this Toys R Us exclusive Evolution group, in my opinion, would consider be, be considered deluxe. As well as the Walmart exclusive Thanos re-release of the build a figure repainted. The Age of Ultron, Ultron GameStop exclusive re-release -re for the Marvel first 10 years. The Guardians of the Galaxy Ronin from the first 10 years. The SDCC Vintage Retro Hulk figure with the pipe. Grey Hulk on the vintage card. And then also the Kingpin on the vintage card. I would also consider all those deluxe even though they weren't in that deluxe box. So next, you had teased us a while back with this image right here in front of the aim. Scientist Supreme. Of course, we all knew it was Modoc. So it is a deluxe Modoc figure, about $50 for this figure, and it comes with a closed box. I could not do an open box with this guy. It just wouldn't fit. There's the back of your package. And he is eight and a half inches tall sitting on that blast effect. They showed you the comparison of the size of him beside the aim scientist there in that picture. And this is cool. He does have two different facial uh, features. You just pop that face right off. So that's pretty cool. Get out there and get your pre-orders on this as well. And there is Dwight popping that face sculpt off so you can see how it works. So really excited about this. I know that uh, some of you probably don't have that toy biz build a figure. I do. Uh, I'll show you in the comparison here in a second. So this is a really cool deluxe figure. And there's the different poses with the different mouths and also the back of the figure. And here is your comparison between the Toy Biz and this new Hasbro deluxe figure. So I will say with Hasbro, it does not have the paint detail that the Toy Biz did. And I know, in my opinion, those crazy lips that the original Toy Biz had uh, was what made that figure for me. So let me know what you guys think about the difference. If you enjoy the Toy Biz better or if this Hasbro Deluxe figure is so much better than Toy Biz. Let me know in the comments. There's all those loose. And in package. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit the notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you have any. Hit the thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys later. And guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos. 